Ladies and gentlemen, please stop protesting illegally and go to your parents' house and protest there because they are the cause of all your problems. It is your parents' fault for having you without reasonable excuse. It's not the government. It's not the government that's to blame. It's not the police. It's all of us. We are all part of the problem. We are all going to die, and that's going to be the end of all your problems, and in your case, the end of some of mine. <laughs> so please, just embrace your mortality. Everything you're doing is a desperate attempt to negate your mortality. But you, these are immortality projects, that's what you're doing. How many policemen does it take to look after a couple of deluded hippies? Police officers, sorry. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I have to congratulate the police for getting paid not that much but quite a lot more than everyone else is getting here for just driving slowly behind a couple of hippies with some vague posters on. What kind of work is that, hey guys? They go out in the morning and tell their wives they're going to spend the day saving us. And what are they doing? just driving down the road in empty big vans for no really good reason other than the fact that there ain't nothing else to do. Why have you not got your masks on you naughty boys and girls? Put your masks on immediately, do as you're told. The questioning of authority will not be tolerated. I repeat, the questioning of authority will not be tolerated. You will do as you are told. Where do you get those masks from? Were they environmentally friendly? Did they come from India or China? And ladies and gentlemen, while we wait here, I want to remind you of the very good news of the new science that has come out recently. The government have announced their experts have come out with some amazing discoveries about the COVID virus. Um, apparently now it is discovered that as from Monday, it will be quite uh, contagious in groups of 30 people. But until Monday, it's okay. The virus will not be attacking people in groups of up to 30. But from Monday, it will be viciously attacking large groups and you are only allowed to have six people. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the good news is though, but the virus has now scientifically been proven not to spread you at work. So it's great news. You can go back to work and have more than six people because we have the scientists on our side. We know the science. And the science says, thankfully, that it does not spread at work. Although it does spread if you sing in a church or a synagogue, unfortunately. The virus has does spread in the... What's that? How did I work that out? But it's obvious the government are taking their orders from the scientists and we have been told that we are not allowed to gather in churches and synagogues. This is obviously based on the science, which is amazing because these are the discoveries of 2020 that they can know with such accuracy how this virus spreads. It was down from two meters to just over one meter plus a few weeks ago, which was an amazing discovery, I think. And. Um, it's important that we understand that we must keep all these rules based on the science of COVID. Now, I don't know how lying down in the road is going to stop climate change, number one. Number two, it's quite nice and warm I'm going to fucking take your thing off here in a minute if you don't shut up. <laughs> You're a fucking dick, right? You need to shut your fucking mouth. Do you have any scientific information that you can share with us, please? <laughs> yeah! Uh, Seriously? Yeah. You only invited you out of the room, I can have a go. What, like? what would you like me to share? No, any any science that you feel, any science that you feel confident reporting on about climate change would be amazing. 
If you want to chat about the fact that we're in a climate emergency and that Parliament was presented with a climate and ecological emergency bill that they are ignoring for another six months, that would be cool. That's, yeah, but there's no point in doing that. That's how the government works. Why do you think, why do you, you think you'll be here otherwise? And why are you, why are you so, why, why do you have a problem with extinction? I think it's, it's okay. Let's just, you know, Fair let's enough. just phase it out. Don't have <laughs> any more out, children. Maybe. Don't have any more children. Okay. And yeah. so that's why I'm here to kind of try and get antinatalism spoken about. Thank you, get for, people thank you for sharing. Freedom of speech. I believe in it. Thank you so Great. much. Pleasure. No he shouldn't be allowed to speak. Uh, no, I'll take it off him. I'll fucking take it off him. Free speech is what what's going on on Parliament Square. Okay. Right? Everywhere is free are speech. You can use it here. That dickhead is allowed to fucking speak to his loudspeaker. You're allowed to use I'll it here. I'll fucking take it off him. Do you know what I mean? 